In campaign 2016 now, the race for president is heating up as Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump prepare to debate each other tonight for the first time. Eyewitness News with a live look inside the Max Sports and Exhibition Center at Hofstra University in New York. In less than three hours, all eyes will be on this room. Eyewitness News is live team coverage leading up to tonight's first presidential debate, including what to look and watch out for from WPRI.com reporter Ted Nisi. But we begin our campaign 2016 coverage with Tim White, who moderates debates for Eyewitness News. You know the old saying, Tim, opposites yep. attract, but I'm guessing it really doesn't apply here. <laughs> Not even close in this case. As part of our panel of experts for our Facebook Live Debate Watch, we will be joined in studio by a Hillary Clinton delegate and a delegate for Donald Trump, and believe me, both have very strong opinions. I think he can do a great job. Donald Trump delegate and Republican State Representative Joe Trillo tells Eyewitness News he's looking for his candidate to come across as a leader. I want him to look presidential. I think that's important. I mean, what is presidential? But I, I also want him to uh, be not afraid to call her out on issues. Well, the first thing I'm going to look for is which Trump shows up. Murth York is a delegate for Hillary Clinton. Who, if he shows up and does restrain himself, uh, you know, some people will consider that he won even if he doesn't indicate that he knows anything substantive about the issue. So you think the bar for Donald Trump is lower than it is for Hillary oh, Clinton? Absolutely. I would tell him stay focused on the issues. Don't be afraid to call her out when she lies, and she will lie. <laughs> How do you respond to that? I have always, this whole campaign, it amazes me that Trump accuses others of the things that he's most guilty of. The two of them, Trillo and York, will be in this studio tonight for our debate watch. Join us on Facebook Live and interact with us in real time. Mike, Shannon, you couldn't find two more polar opposites <laughs> than Joe Trillo in Mirth York. It promises to be very entertaining. Absolutely. No, Tim, you moderate our debates. You know how high stakes they can be. What kind of impact do you think this debate is going to have on voters? Potentially tremendous impact. I mean, think about it. For the most part, people have been getting news about their candidates from watching the news, getting it in bits and pieces, uh, reading an article on them and frankly they might see a meme of a, of a candidate mm -hmm. on a Facebook page that pops up on your timeline. The first 30 minutes of this debate is enormously important to both candidates because they have the opportunity, the opportunity to connect with a voter in a more open forum. Shannon mentioned you've moderated debates for us. Do you have any advice for the moderator tonight? I don't envy them, <laughs> that is for sure, but uh, I would say give them a long leash, right? Let them go back and forth and let them call each other out, but the moderator's job is to keep them focused on the topic at hand, so if a candidate is starting to drift off the question asked, I would say the moderator should rein them in. All right, Tim White, thank you very much.